Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to another video. And today we are going to be testing and reviewing the Edu Laboratories Hair Therapy. Does it work? Does it not? Let's find out together. Hello guys, as I mentioned before, today we are going to be testing and reviewing DS Laboratories. And in my hands today, we have their Revita Hair Stimulating Shampoo and we also have their Spectrum DNC and Breakthrough Desinfying Hair Therapy. Um, these two are brand new, but I actually been testing these two products for the last since October 14th. So it's been what, like October, November to December now. So it's been approximately almost two months since I've been using their products. Um, they were so friendly, they sent me actually a few of their packages. So I do have a few others that I literally almost done with them. And um, these are the ones that they're almost done. Um, so, but, since I review on them, I'm gonna be opening brand new packages and I'm gonna be talking about how they work and how they actually been doing to me, whether they are good or not, and give you guys my final review at the end. So first, we are gonna start with the hair stimulating shampoo. Um, right off the bat, the packaging is really nice. It just comes in plastic wrap. So we're gonna open them out. Okay, opening, opening. So we, we don't need this. Um, one of the things that I actually noticed from the first package I got is their quality of their packaging. It's really nice. Uh, it really has this like really cool um, details throughout their backs. Uh, and of course, they come in different languages. I believe it comes in English, Spanish, and Portuguese and French, literally all the languages that I hope one day I get really good at. <laughs> um, and this, yeah, basically, so let's open this baby up. Shampoo. And this is a brand new bottle of shampoo. Um, right at the back, it actually feels kind of heavy and I just love the really nice soft container to it. Um, as far as I remember, this is all um, recycled paper, so um, really nice and friendly. So on online, the description says, let me just bring this baby out. Uh, Revita hair stimulating shampoo delivers superior results for men and women concerned with hair loss and hair thinning. Revita shampoo is formulated to maintain scalp uh, vitality and protect against follicular dysfunction, achieving the best results in a short period of time course will be the judge of that <laughs> now let's continue with the dispensum D dnc end so let's open this baby up and this one it's more like a spray uh, which i will get more into details about that the other one is just a regular shampoo and by regular i mean just it's just a shampoo for you to wash your hair i'll of course we'll explain later how i use it and all that stuff uh, okay so right at the back when it comes to the packaging it's very similar to the shampoo one um, so it's really nice and um, of course it comes with the instructions and it'll come into four languages etc so for this one it's actually really interesting uh, compared to the shampoo um, at least for me it was really interesting because when I opened it I was like um, what what's going on here like why this comes separate um, I still not sure why it comes separate and this is the actual product so it both comes in this thing so basically what I do is I take the cap out and I replace it well after I open it which I don't think it comes with it yeah so you just open this up and then install the spray part of it now one thing that I actually like about this spray which I hope a lot more brands will do with their spray products um, I know most of them comes with a tab or a cap on, etc. But sometimes you end up losing the caps, especially for someone who travels a lot or just put their stuff in bags and take it away. Um, I not necessarily a big fan of caps when it comes to spray bottles. These literally changed the game for me, and I wish, like I said, I wish a lot of different brands will take this in consideration. Consideration, and that is the fact that this one comes with a clip. It literally comes with a clip. 
and you just clip it back in when you stop using it and you just you know it makes sure you don't spread so even if I take this with me when I'm traveling I'm sure that it's not going to be spreading or spilling anywhere which is very helpful okay so now let's read the description online on their website for this one where is it so for this one it says expansion dncn is first clinical tested topical serum to employ five percent next a powerful new alternative to traditional products with high efficiency and lower molecule weight for better absorption our unique formula developed and recommended by top dermatologists is encapsulated in our prof proprietary nozone delivery system it helps straighten roots and increases the appearance of hair density thickness and value like i said we're going to be testing this baby out and see my final results okay so as i mentioned before i actually been using this product off camera for the last almost two months now um, and this is i'm gonna put somewhere over here my before photo this is how i started um this is how my hair lines is um and if you haven't noticed i actually been letting my hair grow for the last i think the last time i got a haircut was approximately basically i made a decision throughout before the summer started so around may i decided to start letting my hair grow because i am I just want to have different like, hairstyle and see where it goes. So this is basically how it's been. And when they sent me this product, I was really, really surprised and I was really happy uh, because of course, anything that can help me, you know, um, get my hair grow nice and healthy is a best way. But one of my biggest things or biggest issues that I have with me is my hairline on the front. Mostly these two ends, which I'm not, sure if it's called like the crown area i believe it's called so it's always been a very concern of me especially when one of my friends like i believe three or four years ago started noticing they were like oh my god javi what's going on with your head like you're losing hair and i was like oh my god am i going bold and i'm not gonna lie i started having like a few nightmares at night that i've started becoming bold and stuff like that i'm not sure if it's gonna happen in the future time but I mean, if I can do something about it beforehand, why not? So I started using this product, um, and so let me show up my before photos again. Those are my problematic areas, and I started using them as recommended. Uh, is of course we use the shampoo for every time I take a shower. I take a shower every day, and I wash my hair every day now that is growing and actually got to a certain length of course i'm planning on changing that because longer hair don't actually necessarily means to be washed every day um but since then i've been using this almost every day every time i shower basically i change my traditional everyday shampoo to this product um just to test it out am i going to continue you may have to wait till the end for that um the instructions is really easy to just while you shower it, the first thing, of course, to do is to just put a little bit in it and just make sure you have a good amount and just scrap around your hair and make sure you get everything nice and product well distributed. Uh, and then I just leave it there. You're supposed to leave it there for at least three minutes, which for me is basically through while well, I'm waiting for that whole thing to really just bake in my hair I just continue doing and watching other areas of my body and then at the end I just rinse everything off um, like I said I've been doing that almost every day right after I get out of the shower I of course dry myself down etc and then when I go before I put on any lotion or anything on my face or in my body the first thing i do is actually using the spray the um, spension dnc and end dnc end there you go uh, like i said i really enjoy the clip off and what i do is i just spray two sp sprays right on the areas that i need and then sometimes i feel a little more useful and i just literally just go a little more throughout the crown of my head I 
use it right after a shower that's definitely a must for me but then at night i the beginning i started using it before i went to, to sleep so that was really good but then the more i started becoming like more like an everyday situation um i'm gonna be honest i did not use it as planned i did have some days that i did went out and stuff like that and i literally just came home and trash and just crash and whatever and of course i didn't use it but every time i did try to remember to use it at night i would do it um but definitely in the morning so that's basically how i use these two products i've been using them that way for the last almost two months and this is the photos that i have after basically i took them today <laughs> so these are the photos um and we're going to be comparing them um i did notice a lot of changes in my hair as it has been growing which i i wouldn't necessarily say like i'm surprised but at the same time i am surprised so right from the beginning uh my hair was very I didn't really notice how thin it was. Um, it was actually like every time I, like I mentioned before, I was letting my hair grow, I've been letting my hair grow. So around two months ago, it wasn't a good length. It was kind of long and maybe not as long, of course, not as long as it is now, but it was long. So every time I would take a shower, I would literally feel the amount of hair coming out from it. Like I would go like that and I'm like, oh my God, like, what am I doing? Um, should I, should I go back to short hair and save my hair? Because I did feel like every time I would shower, stuff like that, I'm not sure whether because it was long and I was actually kind of pulling my hair out and that was making it me go bold. Um, but then today when I was actually showering, I realized that not a lot of hair comes out, which I was really surprised. Of course, there's still some hairs coming out. There's not like nothing's coming out but there are some hairs but compared to us the amount from the beginning compared to what it is now it has definitely decreased a lot another thing is just by me feeling my hair right now compared to how my hair used to feel the beginning of this process um, my hair now definitely feels thicker which I'm really proud of and not only that but healthier even though it got in longer I definitely feel it stronger even sometimes I just I don't know where I just do this and really like feeling my hair and I definitely feel the thickness and the volume to it um, I know I know I normally tend to have a lot of volume and strength in my hair but I just started noticing growing throughout since I let it since I decided to let them grow I noticed that it got weaker so that's why maybe it, it was a lot falling out when i was taking a shower but ever since it really has been working pretty well so i'm really impressed because i, I don't i'm not a big believer of like vitamins or anything like that uh but i've been testing out a few for the last year or so so i've been really surprised with some of the stuff that i have been trying including the s lavatories um, so the shampoo is definitely a must for me. I've been noticing a lot of changes with it. But now, this Pentrum is the one that has been bringing me a lot of questions. And the reason why I say a lot of questions is because the shampoo, I use it every day and I know it goes all around my head. It goes all around my hair. But the Spentrum is just formulated around my crown and though i did notice um a difference in the hair uh i am a little skeptical about it because i don't sure if is i mean i am i know this doesn't say anything about growing the hair back and you know supposed to give me like a whole set of new hair over two months i mean not even surgical uh procedures can do that because i know they take forever i done my research on that um but one thing i can say is definitely is i definitely see a uh, strength um uh, increase on that because before i noticed 
that every time I will brush my hair this way or stuff like that, I do feel some hair is falling off from this area, which I'm a little bit ashamed to even admit that. Um, but now I honestly like playing with my hair and I feel more confident about the strength of it and I know it's not going to fall out anytime soon. I hope that, but I hope it maintains itself thanks to these products. Um, I will definitely be continue using these products though, um, since I already part of my routine and I already have a few more packages to go through. Um, but I really do enjoy um, putting on this on my hair. So for my final review on these two, um, I mean, after seeing the photos, of course, it's not like, oh my God, like, the hair is not gonna grow up overnight um, but I definitely have seen a difference in my hair I have definitely seen um, my hair getting stronger the color has been amazing this is my natural color so this definitely has seen strength uh, I see less hair falling down um, every time I take a shower um, I am actually obsessed with the shampoo this one, like I said, I'm so skeptical about it, um, but I'm definitely going to continue using it. Um, I really love the way it feels in my hair, and I, like I said, I haven't seen like all oh my god changes on my crown area, but I have definitely seen a more strength in it, and basically still there. So. I'm not expecting like an oh my god miracle from these products or from anything but if you can help making my problem easier or at least froze or stop for a while I take it so for that I am really happy about these products so out of 10 I will give them a good eight so I definitely suggest all of you to try it out um, of course everyone is different but for me that was my opinion that was my review and I did test them out for like I said almost two months um, they have definitely worked on me one way or another and I'm very pleased with the results that I've been getting from these two products so yeah that will be it for my review and testing for these two products what do you guys think? I'm definitely in love with them, as you can see. <laughs> but yeah, let me know if you guys try out these products. I will definitely gonna be uh, writing more about these products on my website at havertist.com. Um, and so yeah, make sure you guys leave a comment, like this video. Don't forget to subscribe for more reviews on a lot of different items or whatever comes up and of course follow me on my personal social media it will be right here um, of course follow us on our website social media which will also be over here and like I mentioned I'm gonna be doing a lot of more reviews and um, talking about these products or where you can actually get them on the box below on on my website which will also be right here Okay guys, thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have a nice day and I guess I see you guys on my next video. Bye!